All righty, here we go again. Dropping back to pass, stepping up in the pocket, delivering the ball. All righty, so I love this. Oh, 13. Look at this man just lay out this defender right here. Boom. Oh, my gosh. Woo. Is number 13 draft eligible? Stanford's tight end and Stanford's number 13. Gosh darn, I'm loving it already. A nice tight throw here over the middle of the field, just getting it over that linebacker. Woof. Perfect touch on this ball over the middle of the field. Fantastic. Here we go. Back in the red zone. Going 50-50. Just barely got it over that one defender again. Look at this. Barely over that. Barely right in that pocket. Right where it needed to be. So we'll give it to him once again. Number 13 in the end zone. Going big. Catching the ball. Love it. All right, against UCLA again. Here we go. Trying to get the win here. Coming back. Down seven with 44 seconds left at the 50. Can the man cap it off? Let's see. Here we go. Throwing the ball at the 50-yard line. Avoiding the sack. Yes, sir. Goes to number 13. Ooh, he's down, though. Ooh, ooh. Does he get injured? Is he out for the season? Did he play for the rest of the season? This is the first game of the season. Well, is it? No, it's not. I lied. It's three. They, they're three and two this, so, far, so far. So it's not the first game of the season. We take that back. But here we go. Oh, 13 still in the game. Here we go. In the red zone. Delivering a strike over the middle. Just putting it exactly where it needed to be. Tie up the game. Clutch ability. Yes, sir. Davis Mills now in double overtime. 50-50 ball to number 13. Oh, my gosh. Drops it right in the pocket. I got to know who the heck is number 13 here for Stanford. Because he needs to get drafted. And I know we have not looked at this man um, all season. So is he draft el eligible? Stanford. Stanford, number 13, we said plus 13, what's number, here we go, <clears throat> number 13, who is Stanford's number 13, holy moly, come on Stanford, come on, go Stanford.com, Number 13, number 13, number 13, here we go, where are you, Ethan Bonner, Ethan Bonner, senior. Oh, yo, yo. He can, he's draft eligible. Is he even in the draft? Um, Career stats. Here we go. Ethan Bonner, man. Number 13. Getting it done here. Oh, he's only... Why'd they say senior? Oh, they say that he's a corner. Okay, hang on. Hang on. The heck? That ain't no corner. Hmm. 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 Interesting. Number 13 here. Oh, this is the wrong highlight package. All right. We got to get a little bit more technical here. We got to break it. I got to see what this man's looking like. I know Davis Mills probably isn't going to work in this league, but I think this, this wide receiver right here, number 13, I'm loving it. Um, so let's go to this UCLA game. Last game that they had, too. Interesting. So, I mean, hey, last game for Davis Mills draws them down in the win to win in double overtime. Absolutely fantastic. We'll take that absolutely all day long. All right. What is this man looking like? What is this man in double overtime? Kyle Phillips. Here it is. Oh, freshman. Sophomore. Sophomore from UCLA. All righty. Watch out for this man next season. He only had 370 yards this season, but in a little bit of a lackluster season. Only two touch. Are we looking at the right man? Because we just saw two touchdowns. It says he's number two. The hell is going on here? What numbers are y'all seeing? What the hell is going on here? Am I just dumb? Am I just not seeing who this man is? It's number 13. It's number 13. What the heck is your name on the back of your jersey? Show us. Show us the back of your jersey. Oh, my God. It just cuts right away. the hell does this say Furman what did number 13 Phillips could this be Phillips no no right no no that's not Phillips I see an M or an N and an A at the end 
All right, folks. I know we're supposed to be looking at this man, but I got there's more pressing things. I need to know the tight end. I need to know this man. Um, what the heck? What more can we do? I know he's number thirteen, and I definitely know that this is not a cornerback. They got two num They don't got two two thirteens. They don't have that. I cannot believe what we are seeing here, folks. How are we not seeing this man? Kyle Phillips. Is it him? Oh, that's UCL. All right, here we go. This is it. All right, here it is. It's Simi Fayoko. Here we go. Here we go. This is it. This is it. Three touchdowns. Did they all come against that UCLA game? All three touchdowns came against that UCLA game. So, hey, he had a fantastic game. Oh, my goodness. No, like, uh, wow. Wow, okay. So he's not that good <laughs> regularly, but he has Davis uh, Mills throwing to him. Is this man in the draft? Is he draft eligible? Simi Fayoko. Fayoko. I'm loving it already, but if he's going into a senior year, he in the draft? I think he is. I think he isn't draft eligible. I think he's in the draft. Prospect grade of four of five point nine three. Is that good? How good is five? Ooh, oh yeah, no, not good, not good. It goes all the way up to eight. But hang on, hang on, hang on. He's five point nine three. That's actually pretty good. What do they say about five point nine three? Five point nine three. Five point eight to five point nine. Backup special teamer. Okay, okay. All righty. What's 6.0? Development traits-based prospect. Yeah, I would say that. Good backup who could become starter. I would give him 6.1 to 6.2. I'm liking it already. Um, all righty. All righty. Oh, he's the cousin of a former NFL player, a Alfred Pupuno. Fayoko Pupuno. No wonder they're cousins. And several other cousins played in college football. So he's got the blood. He's got the college. He's got the NFL blood in him. He's got the blood. Got the blood. <laughs> I came from the bloodline. Y'all don't know my blood. Just look at my blood. I got the blood. Um, all righty. So, okay. All righty. Let's take this, man. Let's watch out for Simi Fayoko going late in the draft, folks. Sixth, fifth, fourth, fourth rounder. Okay, alrighty. Now the other pressing matter. Who is the tight end? <laughs> Who the heck is the tight end? Let's get a number on this man. 81. Oh yeah, 81. Woo! <laughs> yes, sir. Let's see. Let's see this man. Send me a Fayoko. Good luck in the draft, my man. But let's look at number 81. Can we go to 81 now? I mean, he's still number 13. Still, wh wh Where is Femi Aoko? Maybe because he's not on the team anymore. They got rid of him. They kicked him off the page. This is 2021 spring. Yeah, okay. So we got to go to 2020 football roster. All right. So it was just our part not being, you know, not getting the dates right. We just assumed dates would be correct, unfortunately. But let's go back to number 13. Are we getting Femi Oko? Yes, we are. Semi Fayoko. Fantastic. All right. Now we can go to 81 and get the freaking line or the tight end and be fine. All righty. 81. Here you go. Y'all ready? Bryson Tremaine. Let's get his name. He's a junior. All righty. I want to see this man's stats. See if he's draft eligible. All right. Two years in. 265 yards receiving. No touchdowns this year. And he had his best game in 20 in this game we're looking at. 88 yards, his best game against UCLA. Just wild. All right, so everybody's inflated in this game. All right, let's see what they're saying. Is this man in the draft? Uh, probably not. Probably not. He's got uh, only two. I only got two. Don't think he is. We can go back here, actually. Let's go to 2021. Is he still on the roster here in 2021 spring football? I'll give us a better indication if he's draft eligible. We didn't see Semi Fayoko on this. So if we see... Our tight end here. All right, he is coming back, Bryson Trey Main. So watch out for this man next year. Let's keep a mat. Let's keep an eye on this man because I love those one-handed catches. Absolutely fantastic, Bryson. 
Trey Main. All righty. Next year's draft. Watch out for uh, Semi Fayoko this year. Bryson Trey Main next year. All right. Let's go back to Davis Mills here. Let's see if anything's good. Very well done for winning the game here. Very well done to Semi Fayoko. Get it done. All right, here we go against Oregon State. Now this time, just kind of a setup screen. It goes all the way down for the touchdown. Unfortunately, we're not going to see any more Semi Fayoko or Bryson uh, Tremaine because, I mean, both their best games were against that UCLA team. But here we go. Is that Semi Fayoko again? Deep ball. Yes. Yes. Yo, late draft prospect Semi Fayoko, folks. Look at him go up and get the ball. Yes, sir. How deep is this? Let's count the yards. Throwing it from the oh, flea flicker. We'll give it to 40. We're going to call it 40 all the way down to the five. Oh. Oh, boy, that's 50 yards clean, clean. Man, oh, man, 40 all the way down to the five. 55 yards, 50, 55, whatever you want to call it. Here we go. Davis Mills scrambling out. Oh, and the man can run. Some good speed here. Ryan Tannehill-esque. Ryan Tannehill-esque speed, maybe a little faster, a little quicker, it seemed. Look at him go. RT-17, baby. Davis Mills, DM15, RT17. Yes, sir. Speed is speed here. All right. Underthrown ball that was broken up and then luckily caught. All righty. Good catch on the ground. I mean, bad ball here. Way underthrown. I mean, the, cor the corner wasn't even looking behind him. So, I mean, free play for the wide receiver to go make it. All right, here we go against Washington now. A little bit of a back shoulder throw. Let's see how uh, this one looked a little bit inside here. Mm, once again, the defender just a hair away from making a play on that one. All right, back against North or, or Washington here. Nice throw there for 13 yards. All righty, nothing great. Second and four. Let me see Semi Fayoko again. Just getting it. Oh, my goodness. This Washington team has got to be pissed at themselves. They're like, we're just missing these balls by an inch, an inch. And I don't think Davis Mills is perf purposely putting that kind of extra inch on this ball. I don't know, man. All right, here we go against Washington. Big old lead here, 21-3. to three. Anything good here? We might call this. I mean, I'm, I'm already more impressed by the wide receiver and the tight end than the quarterback. I don't care about this quarterback anymore. I care about Semi Fayoko, folks. I want him to get drafted first round. All righty. I'm a little over this Davis Mills guy already. I'm not seeing anything great here. That's a good ball. I'll give him that one. How, th how far is this? Throw him at 40, 30 yards, 35 yards. Nothing great. Okay, we don't need replays. We see it. We see it. All right, here we go in the red zone from the three-yard line. Play action pass. There it is. Yes, sir. Hit him. All right. Took a little bit a while to get there. Got to kind of strike it in. Strike it in right there, right there. Got to strike it in right here. Kind of lobbed it. And it's still good. It's still a good choice, to, you know, but it's open now. You know, he didn't need that kind of extra. Gave him a little extra time for the defender to come over. But still, overall, good throw. We'll give it to him. Nice little kind of lob in the corner of the end zone. Love it. All right, Washington started to come back. Davis Burt, Davis Mills got to do something here. Comeback route, easy. Whew, once again, these receivers. Is this semi -fo uh, semi Fokoo? Number 13, another one-handed catch. Y'all call this man a backup? Oh, I'm calling him a number two. I don't know about backup. But number two, yes, sir. I know we're supposed to be looking at Davis Mills, but I'm looking. I'm loving Fayoko. Semi Fayoko. Yes. Look at this one handed catch. Another one. Fantastic. Oh. All righty. I'm loving this, man. I think we draft Semi Fayoko. Definitely stay away from Davis Mills, but here we go. Taking off. He's got some good speed. He does look quick out there. I will give him that. Going to run again here. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see. Diving down. I like that. Get what all you can get. Don't take the hit. I love it. Ooh. There he is again. What is NFL doing? Give him a 5.9 grade. All 
All right. Good throw there. Good catch. It's not Semi Fayoko, but. All right. I just want to see. Any more Semi Fayoko out here? Who this? That's not Semi. Where's Semi Fioko? Who's this number four? He was looking pretty good there. Runs it in for the touchdown himself. This is in. Fayoko. Watch this man come off the line. Can't get him in the shot. He looks to be all the way down here. Just coming across slanting. Why? He's open. Good catch. 15 yards. Clean. Be clean, baby. <laughs> Fayoko. Not there in the red zone. Damn it. Fayoko here? No, no, Fayoko. Fayoko running the ball. Fayoko getting it in the end zone? No. Fayoko back in the red zone? No. Uh, Fayoko getting sacked? No. <laughs> here we go. Who's this? Took a big hit. That's not Fayoko. Thank goodness. We can't see that man get injured. Here we go. End zone? Not Fayoko. Number four, though. All righty. Here we go. Down the field. Fayoko? No. Number four. All righty. Number four is looking a little impressive, but Fayoko is impressing us a little bit more already. All righty. So, watching Davis Mills, I'm a little bit more impressed with Semi Fayoko, honestly. So, get that man drafted. Definitely good wide receiver depth in this year's draft. Go out and get this man late. He can make it work. How tall is he? Where's Semi Fayoko? Where is he? Sisu! 6'4! Yes! All day! Yo! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Yo, Semi Fayoko, I love this man. Yes, sir. Get this man drafted. Yes, sir. 6'4. Let him be your number one. He's had Davis Mills thrown to him. Come on. Give the man a little bit more credit. Ooh, alrighty, folks. That's going to do it for us today, but I'm jazzed on this, man. I'm about to just watch Semi Fayoko highlights for the rest of the day. Alrighty, folks. That's going to do it.